unboxing video tonight. Yeah, mate, you got to get that out of the box. All right. Well, there's my handy tool. <laughs> lovely, isn't it? Yeah, he's cooking up a storm with the slash four by four, mate. You got a spatula for your unboxing. Oh yeah. Well, I guess here we go, eh? Nice new plastic factory still. Grand unveiling. Sorry about the noise. I think Traxxas make that with that in mind, don't they? I would say so. Anybody can use them. Well, any, you know, I mean, to be honest, well, I think you've got to step up over time, don't you? Yeah, and there's more. I'm not sure if I'm quite at that stage yet. Oh. But by the looks of this, uh, I can see myself getting into a slash 4x4, mate. Oh, that smells like new plastic. New smell, man. Yeah. Um, here we go. I'm just going to zoom out. Right, the Greg Adler special, eh? Don't know who Greg Adler is, but okay, fine. <laughs> Look pretty happy there, mate. Oh, yeah. Huh? You got to be happy with that. What else we in this box, eh? Oh, I reckon the box is a treat in itself, you know, something good for the hobby room. Yeah. Don't mind if I chuck that in the hobby room or what? Nice new TQI. Yeah, chuck that off your Oh, how sweet, sad I got myself a box. So I can pretend I've got a slash 4x4. Four four. Right. My pub's got the real thing here, mate. Mm. Jeez, mate, she looks pretty cool. She's uh, wrapped up oh, nicely. Yeah. There you go, TQI. Almost oh, fair bits. You got the uh, iPhone for that, don't you? Yeah, of course I got it. Nice. Nice. Instruction manuals. All the usual advertising stuff. I'm sure everybody else has seen unboxing of these things half a dozen times, so yeah, I think uh, you know what's in them. I think Jang went through it in the detail. Yeah, of course he did. Which makes it easy for everybody else, because then we can just get to the good stuff without going over all the technical details and you know, yeah, get into the good stuff straight away. Oh. Look at those tyres, nice and new. Nice. What's the compound like, mate? I've heard a few things about them that they're a bit stiff and that, but what, what's that feel like to you? Yeah, a bit hard, but that'll be fine. We'll see how they go. You can always modify the foams inside them. Yeah, see how they travel. Let's get a look underneath this body. Not sure about all these stickers all over it. You know how I feel about stickers? Well, mate, I might just bring the... I might just cut and I'll bring the camera over a bit closer and uh, have a look at the uh, inside of that nice looking truck. Yeah, sure. Mm. Right, so I brought the camera a bit closer, give everybody a look at this. Oh, mate, she looks gorgeous. Look at all your tags, all nice new tags. Gotta love a new RC, don't you? Oh, look at all these pretty blue bits in here. I don't know. I wonder how they'd go with a couple of talons on there. I think she'd go alright to be honest with you. Nice opening in your big balls. I'll give it the Jane test, shall I? He likes to sort of... Not that that means anything to me, but... <laughs> Jane, he's the king of springs as far as I'm concerned. He knows all about his spring setups, doesn't he? he certainly knows his stuff there. Can I just have a grab of it there, yeah, mate? Yeah, go for it, Actually, you know what? That actually feels quite nice. Look at the motion of the ocean. Look at it go. Mm. Beautiful. Yes. Just one thing. Free Charles battery. Said. Free battery, eh? Mm. Okay. Just look at that. Ah, oh, the power cell. Now I'm running those in the summit at the moment. Yes, well, I've gone out and bought myself a nice brand new 3S Lipo to stick in this thing. So, uh, what are you doing with this power cell, mate? Uh, I reckon we can make a bargain on that. I might uh, purchase that off you. It's yours. Hey! Free battery. I love these things. You know what? I've got a use for that. It's quite a nice looking body there, Dave. Yeah, it looks all right. Not too bad at all. Four wheel parts. That uh, sticker actually belongs there now because it's four wheel drive. Mm -hmm. 
I'm glad they made a full drive version. I trust you to go out and get the ultimate. So not not mucking around there, mate, eh? Oh, no, don't do things by halves. Definitely not. Don't do things by halves, so that's why I went out and actually bought myself. What do you got nice there? RPM. Oh, look at that RPM. Front bumper. Oh, mate, look at it. Look at that bumper. Gee, that's solid, eh? Mm hmm. And that'll fit the lights. Yep. Show us the skid plates that you got there. A couple of nice skid plates here. Come with the RPM bumper. Quite thick, too, aren't they? Yeah, I'm just wondering how long it's going to take before I actually snap that. <laughs> Trees do seem to have an awful habit of stepping out in front of me. <laughs> Tell you what, those sway bars, I'm imagining they're going to help. Quite good. Cornering and stuff like that. You've got the rear ones. Uh, you get the center differential as well, don't you? Somewhere in that packet there. You're going to run it with a center diff or without? Without, I'd say. Yeah. Anybody out there's got any pointers or any ideas on these? If you're running one, feel free to throw some ideas our way. I'm sure Puddles will take it on board. Oh, yeah. He wants to get the best out of this beast. Look at that, that's a beautiful Valenian. Love them. Waterproof, that's what you want, eh? Very, Good very job, nice. Texas. Done a great job there. Overall, mate, what's your, what's your first impressions on the truck? Um, I'll wait until I drive it before I give a real first impression. We'll do a follow up review anyway. Yeah, that's what you love to. Sounds good, man. Very nice.